Well, hey everyone, uh, Samuel here from Dino Park Media, and this is just going to be a quick video, no intro or anything today. Um, as you can probably tell from the uh, inflammatory, controversial, whatever it is, it's not necessarily inflammatory, but um, the weird uh, thumbnail for this video, um, I am not going to be watching Camp Cretaceous tomorrow. Uh, it is currently the day, the Thursday before Camp Cretaceous comes out on Netflix, and I have been super excited for it. I have uh, been like <laughs> really greasing the gears in order to do a lot of material and videos for it. Um, and then just, just personally, I've been excited to see it. Being a huge Jurassic franchise fan, Jurassic Park's my favorite movie and everything. And then it comes down to the day before and I'm making this decision to not watch Camp Cretaceous. And it's not because of Camp Cretaceous itself. It has nothing to do with the Universal Studios. It has nothing to do with Jurassic, the Jurassic franchise um, has to do with Netflix and um, excuse me and uh, as most of you probably know uh, or if, if you've been watching the news at all or if you've been watching different videos from YouTube, uh, Cuties, the movie Cuties on Netflix has been in the, in the, in the news a lot and, um, and it, I've been watching the development of this closely for the past uh, three weeks um, hearing about Cuties first of all uh, you know, at the beginning of September, and um, I was still watching. I was still planning on watching Camp Cretaceous at that point. I was like, "Yes, Jurassic World is coming out," but then, um, but then as it, it's developed, uh, Cuties was then released on Netflix, uh, on the Netflix platform, um, and uh, yeah, I just have, I have a problem with the movie, and. Um, so some people, if you're watching this right now, you might be rolling your eyes going like, you're going to allow this to get in front of you just watching something uh, on Netflix. It's one movie. And I and I understand that. Um, it's just, uh, the movie Cuties, uh, if, I'm not going to go into the whole controversy, con a controversy or the whole news thing on that. This, this channel is not meant for news and it's not meant for controversy. In fact, this video is already longer than I want it to be. But um, it has to do with the fact that... Uh, I just, I, I don't like how the movie was made. A lot of people want to make this very political, and it's not a political issue. I'm actually very, pretty upset about how, like, here in the United States, Republicans and Demo Democrats are trying to make it into a political issue and trying to make this another thing to, to divide people. It's actually pretty sick. Because uh, it's not a political issue. Um, to me, it's moral. It's a moral issue. And... I know that people would say, watch the movie. Have you even seen the movie? No, I have not. You know, just to provide that information. Um, I have not seen the movie. And um, I'm not going to. Uh, I did see a portion, a, a clip that's being shared on Facebook, though. I couldn't even finish it. Um, just showing uh, girls that are 10, 11 years old or de uh, depicted to be that age doing uh, sexual, sexual acts. Now, they're not actually having sex or not actually having intercourse, but, um, they're doing things that, that should not be on any sort of, on any form of media. Um, I don't believe that the girl should be doing it in the first place, but it's just, it's sick that this is being made by adults. You know, a lot of people are trying to point to TikTok and saying like, well, look at TikTok. There's plenty of minors on there that are doing the same things. And yeah, I get that. But TikTok the TikToks that are being made out there are also being made by those kids and they're doing it on their own volition and I'm not saying that's okay, but this movie was made by a bunch of adults and they hired underage girls to do these things. And then it, and then uh, since the release of the movie, it's brought out a lot of sickos. Um, there's one video online particularly talking about how, uh, a guy talking about how the, these girls are hot and it's... Uh, it's disgusting. And um, a lot of you, if, uh, well, I say a lot of you, some of you may know uh, if you watched one of my uh, earlier videos on the channel that I'm a youth pastor. And so, yes, I am a Christian. And obviously that does play a part into it. That plays a, a huge part into my whole worldview. Um, but it's also not just, I, I hope it's not just a religious, it's not, it's not just a, uh, a faith-based issue. Um, I hope that other people find the morality in this is is very general that uh, I hope that that the general uh, population of the earth understands that the morality issue of this is pretty 
it's pretty twisted having kids in a position that is that seems quite ex uh, exploitive in, in nature and, it's, and honestly I'm not even mad at the movie I'm not, like the like uh, the movie itself I don't understand like may maybe that has really good story really good like point and moral to the whole plot uh, tr uh, like people are saying it's a feminist issue and stuff like that that's fine but the fact that you hired underage girls to do this and to por be portrayed in in a sexual way uh, I don't have I have a huge problem with that and so Netflix has been defending this film ever since it's come out on the platform and that's why I don't feel comfortable signing up for Netflix I currently don't have a Netflix account I haven't had one for a long time I was actually going to sign up for one today in order to be prepared for Camp Cretaceous coming out tomorrow but I'm not going to sign up I'm not, uh, for Netflix right now because um, <laughs> I, 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 I just hate the idea of uh, supporting a company that is defending the movie Cuties and, uh, and the people that, that made it. So um, you can call me whatever you want in the comments. You can make fun of me. Um, this whole video is not necessarily meant to be like trying to change your, everybody else's opinions. I hope that you understand where I'm coming from and I hope that you do believe that way but I'm not trying to convince you I'm just trying to make the statement that as long as cuties is on the Netflix platform I will not be watching I will not be making Camp Cretaceous content I'm not gonna be watching Camp Cretaceous and that's unfortunate because I was really looking forward to this ever since it was announced officially um, ever since it was teased last year I've been watching the Clayton Fiorita videos about how like there was you know leaks that was coming out last year 2019 and now we're here and I'm not gonna be able to watch it well because of my personal beliefs and so um, yeah I just wanted to make that statement I'm not gonna be watching Camp Cretaceous as long as cuties is on the Netflix platform and that's it however tomorrow I'm still gonna be re releasing another video so you can be watching out for that um, thank you for watching this all the way through if you did and um, I hope you understand where I'm coming from and as always um, more than anything, I want you guys to know that you're loved. So thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next video.